When Bihar released its caste survey, it raked up a storm throughout the country. Meanwhile, the Congress party has proclaimed that it would hold a caste census if it wins in 2024, making it a hot-button talking point in all of its election campaigns. Interestingly, Karnataka has its own caste survey too, which it had prepared back in 2015. However, it has been in cold storage since then, but the momentum to release the report has picked up with the national elections around the corner. Amid this backdrop, on November 22nd, the Federal exclusively broke the news that the survey's original copy went missing way back in 2021. Government officials have only just admitted to it recently. Earlier, they had cited technical glitches as the reason for not releasing the report. The survey prepared by H. Kantaraj, who used to head the Backward Class Commission, went missing from the Commission's strong room. But the problem is that these copies are not authorized versions, so it cannot be accepted by the government, leave alone implemented. The commission is now headed by Chairman K. Jayaprakash Hegde, who is preparing a new report based on the same data. Jayaprakash took charge as chairperson back in 2020 when the BJP government was in power. When the federal questioned Kantaraj, he denied that the report had gone missing. But the current chairman Jayaprakash refusing to comment on whether the original report has gone missing or not said that they are creating a new report based on the same data secured from the systems and it will be submitted to the government before November 24th. However, a day later, a letter emerged that challenged both their versions. In a letter dated October 5, 2021, has been written by Hegde to the Principal Secretary of Backward Classes Welfare Commission, he confirms that the original report has gone missing and mentions that this came to light when the chairman and the current member secretary of the government opened the sealed boxes from the security room. They then asked the former member secretary, Mr. Prasad, to hand over the original report immediately. Officials were searching for the caste census report in August 2021 and that is when they realized that the original copy was missing. This happened after N.V. Prasad, the then commission's member secretary, was transferred. K. Dayanand, who took over, discovered that the original report was missing. So the question lingers why the BJP, who were in power back then, did not report this issue. Chief Minister Siddharamaya, however, claimed that he was not aware of the missing report. According to sources, Siddharamaya plans to tackle the issue only after the results of the upcoming five-state assembly elections in December. However, if the report does get released, there are still legal challenges to overcome. The commission may need to clarify the legitimacy of the report and explain why the earlier report was not submitted. Former members of the commission during Kantaraj's leadership have met Siddharamaya and some are even prepared to go to court once the Hegde report is submitted. Even if they sort out the legal problems, tensions seem to be brewing in political circles. In Siddharamaya's party itself, some important caste groups like Vakaligas and Lingayats oppose the idea of a caste census as they fear reclassification of castes could get them sidelined. Siddharamaya's deputy DK Shivkumar too is against it and has signed a memorandum urging the government to reject it and conduct a survey in a scientific way. So it will be interesting to see how the Congress handles its primary caste survey plank for getting back in power when a state ruled by the party seems to be in two minds over it and dithering to implement it. Subscribe to the Federal's YouTube page for more news and updates.